Welcome to Tech Glimpse X. Today we are diving into one of the most cutting edge and technically challenging topics in the world of technology, quantum computing. Prepare for an in-depth exploration of the science, mathematics and engineering behind this revolutionary field. Buckle up because we are going deep. So first, we are going to talk about what is quantum computing. To understand quantum computing, we first need to grasp its core distinction from classical computing. Classical computers process information using bits, which can exist as zero or one. In contrast, quantum computers utilize qubits or quantum bits. Here are the key properties of qubits. First is superposition. Unlike classical bits, qubits can exist in combination of states such as 0 and 1 simultaneously. Mathematically, this is represented as linear combination of busy states. Second, entanglement. When qubits become entangled, the state of one qubit is dependent on the state of another, regardless of the distance. This phenomenon enables highly correlated computations. Third, quantum interference. Quantum states can interfere constructively or destructively, allowing quantum algorithms to amplify correct solutions and cancel out incorrect ones. Now comes the hardware of quantum computing. Building a quantum computer requires cutting-edge hardware technology. Let's explore the main approaches. First, superconducting qubits. These are implemented using circuits made of superconducting materials. Companies like IBM and Google use this approach. The Josephson junction is a key component enabling controlled quantum tunneling. Second is trapped ions. Ion-based qubits are confined using electromagnetic fields. They are manipulated using laser pulses which induce state transitions with high precision. Third, topological qubits. An emerging approach that encodes information in quasiparticles particles called Majorana fermions. This method promises higher error tolerance. Fourth, Photonic quantum computing. It utilizes photons as qubits. This method takes advantage of quantum properties of light such as polarization and phase. Now comes the quantum algorithms. The power of quantum lies in its algorithms, which leverage the properties of qubits to solve problems more efficiently than classical methods. Let's break down the most significant quantum algorithms. First is Shor's algorithm, a groundbreaking method for factoring large integers essential for breaking RSA encryption. It uses quantum Fourier transforms to find periodicity in modular arithmetic. Second is Grover's algorithm. It is designed for unstructured search problems. Grover's algorithm offers a quadratic speedup by iteratively amplifying the probability of correct answer. Third is quantum approximate optimization algorithm also known as QAOA, a hybrid classical quantum approach for solving optimization problems in fields like logistics and machine learning. Fourth is quantum machine learning. Algorithms such as quantum support vector machines 
QSVMs and quantum neural networks QNNs hold promise for processing massive data sets. Now comes the challenges in quantum computing. Despite its potential, quantum computing faces significant technical challenges. Some of the tech challenges are so the first challenge is decoherence. Quantum states are fragile and can lose coherence due to interactions with the environment. The average coherence time for today's qubits is in the microsecond to millisecond range. The second challenge is error states. Quantum gates are prone to errors due to hardware imperfections and noise. Implementing error correction requires a significant overhead of physical qubits. Third challenge is scalability. Current quantum systems operate with tens to hundreds of qubits, far from the thousands or millions needed for practical applications. Fourth challenge is cryogenic cooling. Many quantum computers require temperatures close to absolute zero, achieved using dilution refrigerators which adds to the complexity and cost. Now comes the future of quantum computing. What does the future hold for quantum computing? Here are some key developments on the horizon. So the first is quantum supremacy demonstrating tasks that are infeasible for classical computers. Google's Sycamore processor achieved this milestone in 2019, solving a random circuit sampling problem in 200 seconds. Second is quantum advantage, achieving practical improvements over classical algorithms and real-world applications like logistics and finance. Third, integration with cloud platforms. Companies like AWS, Microsoft and IBM are offering quantum computing as a service, democratizing access to quantum hardware. Fourth, quantum cryptography. Leverage quantum properties to create unhackable communication systems through quantum key distribution. Now comes the quantum computing in scientific research. One of the most promising applications of quantum computing is in the field of scientific research. Here are some key areas where quantum computing is expected to make breakthroughs. First is drug discovery and molecular simulations. Quantum computers can model complex molecular interactions at the quantum level, accelerating the development of new pharmaceuticals and materials. The Hamiltonian of molecular systems can be efficiently simulated using algorithms like variational quantum eigen solver. Second is climate modeling. Quantum systems can process massive data sets and solve differential equations more efficiently, enabling precise climate predictions and solutions for global warming. Third, astrophysics and cosmology. Quantum algorithms allow scientists to simulate black holes, dark matter and quantum gravitational phenomena, expanding our understanding of the universe. Fourth, fundamental physics. Quantum computers are being used to explore quantum field theories, lattice gauge theories and high energy physics problems that are intractable for classical computers. So, 
quantum computing is no longer a distant dream. It's rapidly becoming a reality. While challenges remain, the breakthroughs in the field are poised to revolutionize technology, science, and society. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with the latest in tech.